Um, um, excuse me, sir. So, will Elvis Presley be attending the Astro Dome with the Sweet Inspirations? Can you confirm or deny that, please? Wow. <laughs> A black reporter. I guess times is changing. But check this out. Hear he, hear he. Elvis Presley will not be performing with the nigga gals. There will be no sweet inspirations. No sweet inspirations. I repeat. Um, another question. Is there a reason why they will not be attending? Who is this nigga? Is it just me or did the room just get dark to the motherfucker? But to answer your dumbass question, um, it's not even about racism. Because I know that's where you're going with that. It's not about racism. We just don't like niggas. We just don't like niggas. And why they can't come is because our lighting is not that good. And the microphones will not reach in the parking lot. During the 60s and early 70s, when tensions between blacks and whites were at an all-time high, Elvis demonstrated his desire for racial reconciliation in the musicians that he chose and the treatment they received. saying is, fuck equal rights. The Klan don't support no nigga, no nigga, making over 20,000 a year, get along being famous. When we first decided to um, take the gig with Elvis, we had no idea that there would be any racial flack regarding it. I tell you, that nigga lover, uh, that nigga lover Elvis, that nigga lover had a sweet tooth. That nigga lover took the sweet inspirations all across America like this was some type of ghetto motherfucking Olympics. Our first racial encounter was when we went to um, Texas. Elvis was told by his people that, well, you can leave the black girls home. You don't have to bring them. So I booked that nigga lover Elvis for a show in Texas, and everybody was excited, including me. But we were all all worried about him bringing them damn nigga gals down uh, to the stadium. So I called his people and told uh, them to tell him to leave those nigga gals, a.k.a. you leave those goddamn apes at the motherfucking zoo that you call Graceland, white power. So Elvis wasn't going to do the Astrodome unless his girls could be with him. So that nigga lover called me back and informed me that he wasn't going to do the show. And my heart just dropped. My poor little clan heart. I had a lot of clan dollars invested into this damn show. And he demanded that we be given the star treatment. We had to be in our convertible where everybody could see us. <laughs> and our little blonde could drive us. <laughs> and um, that was his statement. You don't like it? Deal with it? Or I'm not going to be there. And I thought that was very big of him. Yeah, that shit happened. That's true. It happened. But I'll tell you what about that son of a bitch. That nigga lover there, that nigga lover there. It was so hard for me to find somebody comfortable enough to drive them nigga gals around the stadium. But i tell you what, a few weeks prior to this, I had caught my uh, sister's daughter listening to that nigga Charlie Pride. So shit, I made her drive him. 